Wildfires have already erupted in some areas of northern Wisconsin and here in Madison, a high fire danger alert has been issued due to the dry conditions, which could lead to the possibility of bushfires. Chloe Morrissey has you covered on how fire departments tackle these fires and the precautions you can take. According to the DNR, the Madison area is under a high fire danger. Lieutenant Eric Brinkman with the City of Madison Fire Station 12 says because of little moisture in the ground and overall dry conditions, it leaves the perfect conditions for wild land fires. Be smart and most everybody probably was taught not to play with matches when they were a kid and it, it, uh, it can be a dangerous thing. Brinkman says that something as small as a discarded cigarette or ashes from a fire pit can float off in high winds, starting fires. He warns that if conditions stay this dry, controlled burning, and even 4th of July fireworks may not be able to happen. His station is equipped with a special vehicle that they use when they receive a call that there's a brush fire. And with the winds that we're having, they'll tend to spread quickly. The wind can change directions, which can make it a dangerous situation. Station 12 says that their truck helps because of off-roading capabilities, but down at Mount Horeb Fire Department, they have an additional piece of equipment to help fight these fires. In addition to their own brush truck, Mount Horeb Fire Department has an ATV, a smaller vehicle holding about 80 gallons of water that is able to get to more remote off-road areas, which is typically where brush fires burn. Mount Horeb Fire and EMS Chief Jenny Minter says that those who want to enjoy these warmer days by the fire pit need to take precautions when conditions are drier. The wind can cause embers to um, start up again and spread after you're done or you think you're done. Those choosing to do controlled burns during high risk conditions should refer to the DNR website to see when it is best to burn, Minter says, noting that early mornings and evenings tend to be the best times due to less wind. In Madison, Chloe Morrissey, 27 News.